I actually need this. This is uh, one of the devices that I use for my students. This is now my 13th year with LPS. I started out actually as a fifth grade teacher at Belmont Elementary. My kindergarten teacher at Freestream Elementary. And I always tell people that she was my boss when I was five and then she actually hired me when I started at Belmont as a fifth grade teacher. Education doesn't mean that you have to just teach one subject. Morning. There's lots of different pathways you can choose from, whether it's special education, elementary, secondary, or even becoming a vision teacher someday. Do you know which way you're going? You might have gotten turned around just a little bit. That's okay. Do you hear that? That was a good clue, actually. Oh, yeah. Okay. The restroom. Okay, so thinking of that, if that's where the restrooms are located, which way do we need to go to, to my classroom? I think this way. Yeah, to the left, right? So you're in that intersecting hallway right now. Yep. I'll meet you down there in just a second, okay, buddy? I'm one of seven uh, vision teachers that supports kindergarten through 21 years of age. The new computer that you've been using, I changed some of the accessibility features when I first set it up for you. I want to go through and show you how to use some of those features on there. Excellent. There you go. If you go in the upper right hand corner to where the little magnifying glass is at, you need to zoom in, I can help you too. My like, 17, 18 year old self would probably have laughed at the idea of me being a teacher someday. And it's simply just because it's not something that I had necessarily thought about at all. Do you usually use your, your left hand more than anything? What I want you to do is take two fingers and, and, and move forward on the trackpad. You can not only hear the excitement, but I mean, you see it on their faces when we work through different things. Push and then, yep, you can zoom in and out. Whoa, <laughs> isn't that cool? That is cool. <laughs> and what it's gonna do, it's gonna focus on wherever your mouse is at. So if we move your mouse over here. My favorite aspects of my job is the fact that I get the opportunity to work on such an individualized basis. When it's a one-on-one, -on -one, it's way better to focus. But when you're in a classroom, it's like, ugh. I think LPS really does a very, very nice job of allocating and making sure that students are taken care of and that they have the necessary technology. So if you read the Braille, then I think you might be on an empty line. You may need to come down just one. You're going to cycle through until you get to the folder. Whether it is through Chromebooks or like integrating new apps. If a para or a teacher walk by, they, they can see the braille that he's, he's working with in real time on the iPad screen. That's, it gives me chills to think about because it's so empowering that he has direct access to that. Doing great, bud. <laughs> I know my job is very, very specific. It's, it's very individualized. Let's go, Nathan. Right. Oh, you ready? Here we go. Okay, come on over here, buddy. Can you grab it? The same holds true for when I taught fifth grade. <laughs> you have that possibility to, to impact a lot of kids and a lot of families in a very positive way. It's definitely a very rewarding career.